Okay, so my wife is on Facebook all the time and sees these recipes that everybody's sharing on Facebook and she always sends them to me. She'll tag me in them. And this is one that caught my eye. It's got fresh flavors. Uh, I'm in the salads right now and things that you can bring to picnics because it's spring and people are getting outdoors. So come on in close. I'm gonna show you how to make this spaghetti salad. So let's run down the ingredients. I have two different colored bell peppers, an English cucumber, which has less seeds than a regular cucumber, yellow squash, zucchini, three Roma tomatoes, sliced black olives, some extra sharp cheddar cheese and a box of thin spaghetti. Not angel hair, but the one up from it. And then this is what's going to make our dressing, your favorite Italian dressing to start with, whatever you want, some Parmesan cheese, some garlic, and some paprika. Okay, so when you get your thin spaghetti box out, I want you to get a grip on the spaghetti, okay? And just kinda break it and drop it. And do that a few times. You may want to do smaller amounts. <laughs> there we go. And then you want to immediately stir it. Some of you put salt in the water for flavoring. Some of you put oil in. I'm going to do both. So let's do that right now. Now, this is mainly for flavor. It's going to cook in. And this is to help it from not sticking a little olive oil. It's gonna coat all the noodles. So you wanna mix this all around real good and cook this normal. And then I want you to rinse it all off and then strain it and cool it. So I want these noodles to be cool, okay? Okay, this is gonna be a big salad. So there we go. Okay, I've got my, let's do black olives. Black olives right here, put those in. Red and green bell pepper. Here's zucchini. My yellow squash. Oh, I'm sorry, that wasn't zucchini, that's uh, English cucumber. <laughs> it's hard to tell when they're all diced up. This is zucchini. Tomatoes, red onion. Wow, this is a big bowl. I think I'm gonna get a, <laughs> I'm gonna get a bigger pot. So I've moved it into this pot here and I'm just tossing it around so much easier. Got a glove on here, I'm gonna, cause I'm gonna have to mix it again once I put the dressing on. All right, so pour your Italian dressing into the bowl. Do, 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 do. I'm just gonna squeeze it all out. Now a little garlic. I'm eyeballing it, you guys can do what you want. When you do the recipe, you can follow the recipe, you just, just eyeball it. And a little paprika. Mix this up. Get our thing here, our pot of salad. Pour the whole thing on there. Beautiful. That's what it looks like. Ew. Grab my little spoon and toss it around. Uh, I forgot one of the main ingredients and the reason why I forgot it is I threw it in the fridge to keep it cold and chilled the little bits of uh, the pieces of cheese. I'm gonna toss in here real quick before I eat it. And sometimes cheese wants to stick together, so make sure you kind of crumble it apart so that you don't have big chunks other than the ones you cut. And there it is with the cheese added in. It looks absolutely beautiful. Spaghetti salad, booyah. That is like totally an easy recipe. You can prep the ingredients the night before if you want, throw it all together at the end when, before you go over to a party or do a picnic. This is a great recipe, I can't wait to try it. All right, I got a little bit in the bowl, got all my little vegetables in here. It looks beautiful, doesn't it? I know you wanna make this. It's too simple. You guys probably change things. Um, artichoke hearts would be great in this. So let me know what you guys think of this recipe and let me know what you would probably swap out or you'd add to this. You guys have some great suggestions, here we go. Mm. Okay, that Parmesan cheese, oh my gosh. The red onion, the Parmesan cheese, the Italian dressing, it just glides in your mouth. The spaghetti is perfectly cooked. Oh man, oh, my family can be so stoked they're gonna chow on this tonight. This is gonna be a side dish, uh, probably with um, leftovers or something, I don't know. I haven't figured out what the main dish is yet, but I think they're just gonna be on this as soon as they walk in that door. 
It's awesome. Try it. I will see you on the next episode. Take care.